What is going on guys, Flick here and welcome back to another episode of FIFA 16 Career Mode Player Reviews. Today we'll be having a look at Leroy Sané. This guy is absolutely tearing it up in the Bundesliga this season and a fun fact about him is that his dad, Soliman, also played the Bundesliga. So in many ways he's following in his dad's footsteps. But if you guys do go on to enjoy this review today, make sure you leave a like down below and also leave some player suggestions for me to review in the future. At the start of crew mode, Sané is a 74 rated 19 year old showing great potential with a real value of 3.7 million. 7 million is going to be the inquired price from Schalke, which is not too much. Uh, considering that is only about double his value and the potential that he can reach. We'll take a look at his player information. And you can see he has the versatile ability to play left mid, right mid, or striker. He's left footed, high medium work rates, and has three star weak foot and three star skill moves. Does have the finesse shot trait right from the start and no specialties. We'll look at his base attributes now and you can see he's very well rounded in the physical attributes. Already 88 acceleration and 90 sprint speed, which is fantastic for a 74 rated player. His technical attributes aren't too bad either with 77 ball control and 82 dribbling, but we'll jump into the clips and I'll talk a little bit about his pros and cons. For each of the clips that you're about to see, you'll be seeing Sané in the left wing position. I want to get him in a more attacking position so that way he can score some more goals and create more opportunities. But his main attribute has to be his speed with 95 acceleration and 97 sprint speed. He's just so quick on the ball and you can see he just runs by players with ease and that puts you in a really good position to either send in some crosses or just do it yourself and have a shot with Sané. Also his dribbling is fantastic with 94 dribbling, 90 ball control and also 94 agility. The agility really does stand out. You can see him change directions really easily and just get by players with ease. Uh, his long shots are also incredible with 91 long shots and 89 curves. So you can go with the finesse shot or the power shot from outside the box. And you'll see he does get it on target most of the time, as you can see right there. His stamina was also quite good at 83. I didn't have any issues with him tiring out too easily. And I was using him with his full sprint speed for most of the game. A couple of cons to talk about is his three star skill moves. I would have liked four star skill moves on him, especially for a winger and his crossing could be better. It's only at 78 and for an 86 rated player, you gotta do a little bit better than that. Finally, his strength could improve. It's only 66 strength, but with his speed and dribbling, that does take a little bit of that away. He can just run around the defenders instead of going right into them. At his peak, Sané does reach an 86 overall rating and a value of 29 million. That's a huge increase of 25.3 million from the start of career mode. And he does manage to pick up the speedster, dribbler, distance shooter, and acrobat specialties along the way. And finally, we'll look at his attributes and insane growth for his physical attributes. He's already good to start off with. And look at that agility, plus 16. Wasn't expecting that when I started using him, but I was pleasantly surprised. And also the technical attributes saw some good growth. Ball control ending at 90, dribbling ending at 94, curve ending at 89, and his long shots ending at 91. Man, he was a fantastic player to use, and I'm gonna give him an overall rating of 9.5. If he had those four star skill moves, I'd probably give him something like a 9.8, but definitely would recommend trying this guy out. He's not too expensive, and I had a lot of fun using him. But guys, that's going to bring an end to the review today. If you did enjoy today's review, make sure to leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. And until next time, this has been Flick. I'll be talking to you guys again soon.